Pisces, what's up? And welcome to Notero. I am an energy and intuitive reader, and I'm here to do the general readings for the Pisces. What's up, my guys? I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you so much for being here. I do want to say this message could resonate for you if you have Pisces as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus. Yeah, Pisces. What's going on with ya? I hope you guys are doing well. Let's see what's going on. Let's see. Sorry, I'm fixing my crystals. All right, so we're going to pull some vitamin cards for you, Pisces. And then we're going to do the tarot and then some advice at the end, okay? All right, sorry, Pisces. Pisces. Follow your heart in something. Okay. Huh? I love when they give me three here. Okay, bottom of the deck is simplicity. Okay. Simplicity going forward and courage. Okay. So what you don't see coming is there's a need for you to keep things simple, keep things light, right? Only do the things that need to be done. Don't over exaggerate. Don't overextend yourself. Just do Keep things simple, okay? Um, you're going to be this energy of move, of going forward. Wow, look at how beautiful this card is, guys. Just look at it. I just love it. Um, the, you're going to be in a lot of, in your mental state, it's going to be a lot better, okay? A lot more clear. Things are going to be a lot more clear. You'll be able to understand things a lot better. And courage. You're going to get a lot of courage to do something here because I feel like people or you maybe could have been going against yourself in a certain energy because i did say that you should listen to your heart and trust yourself what did i say in the beginning i don't remember i get when i'm shuffling sometimes i get messages and i just say them out loud but i anyway whatever i said there you know there could be people that are going to be challenging you so courage is going to be needed all right that's what they're saying to keep things simple keep things light okay you don't need the drama all right pisces all right, let's talk about what you got here. Hold on, let me fix this. Okay, so, stillness. So there's something that Spirit is asking you to stand, stay still. Don't do anything, don't make a move, don't make a decision. There's something that, that they want you to just leave alone for a minute, okay? We're gonna clarify, we're gonna see what that is patience makes sense right what they will why they want you to leave something alone and not touch it because they want you to have patience in something as well they want you to take some time for something right think something is going to take some time all right and then you have healing chaos so you could be healing a lot of wounds right now they could be i feel like it, it's like one it's like one wind after another it's like one thing after another after another after another and i feel like you haven't given yourself time to heal um, because you're too busy doing everything else here or too busy worrying about something and you need time to heal so we're gonna we're gonna see what's going on with you pisces okay What else, Spirit? Can you clarify that? Clarify. Can you clarify stillness? Why stillness here? Why stillness here? Why stillness here? So the first card that you got was the Nine of Swords here, okay? There's something that's really worrying you, okay? There's something that's really worrying you here. Um, the Nine of Wands, and then you got the Three of Wands. I feel like, first of all, you, you're you very doubtful of something here, okay? And I think it's a love connection, okay? You got the Ace of Cups, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Ten of Cups at the bottom of the deck, okay? There's a new there's a there could be a possible new beginning in love for you here okay temperance five of cups king of swords 
then you have the five of pentacles and the three of cups underneath that but there's a need for you to heal here there's a need for you to heal um with the five of cups you're you're like oh why me oh why me kind of energy the five of pentacles you feel left out again oh why me you're very sad you're very sad with the nine of swords you're very worried here um and the king of swords it's like spirit wants you to cut out this five of cups energy feeling bad for yourself okay um the reason why this new beginning hasn't began and it's it's not moving is because you need to heal which we see here with the healing chaos you need to heal there's something that you still haven't moved on from here okay um could have to be around celebration some friends or something like that okay the magician and the fool is here once you heal that you'll be able to create this new beginning but it's worrying you because you, it's not coming in this new beginning and it's like you know that it's coming of course you're a pisces you're very intuitive you know that it's coming and it's not and it's not there or maybe you got a taste of it and then you know it you got it quickly removed from you but that's because you have to heal you haven't healed properly so this new thing can't come in properly okay patience patience very can clarify patience I have patience here. <sighs> Four of Cups. I also feel like for a lot of you, um, it's not moving because it's showing you patience, right? You could want it to, to go at your speed and Spirit is trying to show you, no, 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 no. You can't control this. This is going to go at the speed that it's meant to go at, right? With the Four of Cups, you're, you're very discontent with life right now. You're very, like, not happy. Um, and Spirit is asking you to have patience. There's a lot of illusions with the Seven of Cups, Two of Wands, and Two of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Two, two here. Your decision, you're trying to make a decision, but your decision is blocked. And I feel like Spirit is purposely blocking your, your decision here. Um, you With the Two of Wands, you're trying to look, Pat, you're trying to look, you know, um, like, you're trying to look further into something. You're trying to look deep into something. Um, you could be trying to look a different direction because your vision is blocked right but spirit is blocking it on purpose all right knight of pentacles ten of cups the four of swords the three of swords and the ace of cups yeah you're hurt in love even though you could not be trying to acknowledge it your feelings are hurt here in love okay and um seven of cups two of wands there's illusions here it's that you're it's like you feel this contentment, but that's not really what it is. It's an illusion. It's not really how you feel. It's the way you're looking at things here. Your vision is blocked, so you're not seeing everything the way it's supposed to look. Be look, as you're not looking at everything the way it's supposed to be looked at here. Okay, the Knight of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, the Four of Swords. You're, you, something is moving very slowly into the Ten of Cups. Like you're gonna get it, but it's gonna be slow. And it also depends on how fast you heal that you're gonna get this Ace of Pentacles this new prosperous beginning okay but you gotta quiet your mind here and heal this 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 hurt for heart that you have okay or this pain that you feel healing chaos spirit can you clarify healing chaos queen of wands all right they want you to be in your power they want you to you know be vibrant sing dance change up your energy here the three of pentacles the knight of swords and the, the world once you heal this, you're going to be completing this chapter. It'll be closed and you'll be able to get this new prosperous beginning. I mean, I told you that. The Three of Pentacles and Knight of Swords. You might need help from family members, collaboration, a teamwork here. Um, I feel like there's also saying you have a team behind you that's willing to help you. You have a team surrounding you that is willing to help you with this healing process here. And they want you to, with this healing process, come out let the real vibrant pisces come out let the let that energetic flow and let it touch everybody else here king of wands six of swords the star card yeah healing once you heal you're gonna get this wish fulfillment like it's just gonna happen you're gonna be moving into calmer waters things aren't gonna seem as eh, as they are right now but you need to heal point period blank pice okay point period blank all right let's pull the tarot <sighs> Pisces, Pisces, spirit. Things are gonna be moving forward. Things will be. 
As long as you take the time to heal your hurt heart, okay? Pisces. That love that you pour into everybody else, pour into you, okay? Pisces, sir, Pisces. Three of Pentacles is here again, okay? Thank you, sir. One more for Pisces. One more. Thank you. Y'all gotta get out of this lack mindset, Pisces. Y'all have to, okay? Eight of Cups at the bottom of the deck. All right, let's see. Eight of Cups. Yes! Ten of Pentacles, the tower. I love to see it. And you have the Lovers and the Two of Wands and the Hierophant. Okay, okay. All right, let's talk. So, Six of Wands. All right, you're gonna be, you're gonna have a lot of victory, a lot of success in something here. Okay, some of you guys could be getting public recognition in something as well. Your count, your confidence is like peaking. Good for you. All right. Then you have the Nine of Pentacles. So, excuse me. Again, success. I love it. Abundance self-sufficiency like you you got it going on Pisces. i like this you got this going on some of you guys could be working a lot right now a lot all right three of pentacles you, there's a need for you to collaborate and work with people here okay or you are in that energy and then you have the five of pentacles lack mindset you you don't have enough you you know negative thinking um lack mindset worrying about money you could be worried about money here okay you could be feeling left out by a taurus um karma is going to be served in that situation okay they're going to come and offer you something they could they could want their family back it's gonna it's gonna go like you're gonna get good karma from that okay knight of cups king of pentacles this person's gonna come in a lot more stable that's for some of you guys Whew, i just saw 12 12 that's definitely not for all of you i just all those cards fell and i was inclined to read it so if that resonates with you then great but it's not gonna resonate with all of you um bottom of the deck is the eight of cups the ten of pentacles in the tower you're walking away from this worry energy this lack this lack um because this is how you ended this spread here okay but then the bottom of the deck is an eight of cups so you're walking away from this energy and i love it walking right into ten of pentacles into your fulfillment your abundance here with the cherry it's going to be a lot of changes when it comes to your love life romance a lot of big changes okay a lot of shifts here um but just have courage okay have courage and only do things that you need to do keep things simple don't try to overextend yourself no 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 none of that none of that okay spirit doesn't want that for you okay all right spirit six of wands can you clarify six of wands yeah six of wands here six of wands three of pentacles is here again oh my gosh King of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, and the Justice. I feel like you guys are going to be very successful in something if you work together with other people, collaborate as a team here, which I do see you guys doing. King of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, Justice. You're going to get good rewards out of this. Okay, it's going to make you very stable here. Um, I like this. You're going to get good karma here. King of Pentacles, I like that though. Like that's that's stability at its finest. Okay, Knight of Cups, emotional investment. You might um you might invest emotionally into this, all right. But I still see good things. Nine of Pentacles, so you can clarify Nine of Pentacles. Page of Swords here. For some of you, I just got that you could be working with other people here. Um, and you're wondering if you're going to be successful with working with the, with that team. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Okay. Queen of Wands, Five of Swords, and the Page. Oh, 
I don't know why it's that page. Queen of Swords. All right. Oh, the Page of Swords is right here. <laughs> to clarify, Nine of Swords, you got the Page of Swords here. So you guys are going to get some communication, okay? Someone's really going to acknowledge how the success that you're doing, how well you're doing. They're really going to say something to you here, okay? Um, make sure you don't stop thinking. Don't think negative, okay? That's all the Devil card, so... Don't think negative here. With the page of swords, I feel like somebody's going to communicate with you some achievement, some abundance. They, they, they might tell you, oh, hey, look, you know, they might offer you something. They're going to speak to you something regarding your home or your money here. Okay, Queen of Wands, Five of Swords, and the Queen of Swords. You've been battling yourself a lot about whatever this person's going to come and tell you. Or what they're going to tell you is going to make you, like, question yourself or question it. You're going to be battling yourself. Page of Swords. Yeah, again, they're going to come and speak to you. They really are. Uh, but the Queen of Wands. <sighs> I feel like somebody might tell you how cute they think you are. How attractive you are. Okay. How they love how you take care of yourself. And, you know, your pets or your children. Okay. With the Queen of Wands. Um, and you might look at them like, excuse me, what? Like, you, you're going to really be like, is that really what you mean? Type of energy. Um, but there's definitely going to be somebody coming and telling you, you know, making you feel good here. Three of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles, can you clarify? You got the Nine of Pen the Nine of Swords and the Knight of Swords. Sorry, the Nine of Wands. Hmm. Page of Cups, King of Swords, Ten of Swords. Yeah, I mean, like I said before, some of you guys are, are kind of like doubting if this teamwork that you're in, this collaboration that you're in with people is, actu is actually going to um, get you to the place that you have to be here. But I see you very determined. Even though you're questioning it, you're still determined. You're like, yeah, I'm there. On the bottom of the deck is the Page of Cups, the King of Swords, and the Nine of Swords. You're really worried. You're really worried if this is going to, you know, bring you what you want here. With the Page of Cups, there's a need to listen to your intuition. Um, I also feel like you're going to get, like, there's going to be something that, like, a good love offering is going to come out of this. So I would say stick, stick in there. Okay, with the King of Swords, you're trying to find the truth here. Um... There's a need for you to speak the truth as well. Okay. Five of Pentacles. Can you clarify five of Pentacles? Why are five of Pentacles here? You got the five of Cups. Damn. Damn. Now, these energies could change, right? These energies could change. Some of you could have lost your job here, and now you're all down in the dumps. Um, a lot of you just have this... this this lack mindset where it's like I don't have enough you know and it's like you have to be grateful with what you have in front of you Pisces all right be grateful with the things that you do have okay don't worry about your 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 mindset is, is worrying about too much about what you don't have right you could be looking at your team or this person or this energy that you're working with and you're like you know I need more people I need you guys to do more whatever but it's like they're doing what they can right acknowledge what they are doing here because you're just like really down in the dumps ten of sword i'm sorry <laughs> ten of swords you're battling you, you've like hit rock bottom as well but you have the ten of wands the eight of wands and the seven of cups all this saddy saddy energy is creating illusions in your environment it's making things seem like they're a lot harder than they really have to be it's making you believe certain things that you don't that aren't really there you're going to get communication, all right? This this extra responsibility that you've, that you've been taken up on, you're going to get communication on it. The Tower, the Star card, and the Six of Cups. Somebody from your past, okay? It could be about children as well. It's a good deal. You need to heal. You need to heal. That's it. Heal. The Star is about a wish of fulfillment, but it's also hope, and it's also renewal, and it's also healing. Okay, the temperance is also healing, balancing energy, the tower. Something is going to get knocked down. That's probably why you're over here all sad. Something probably a huge change, drastic change happened that caused you to feel like you lost something. Okay? Um, but you won't stay in that energy for long is what I'm going to tell you, Pisces. All right? And also, look at what you still have. All right? 
try to look at what you still have instead of what you lost because you being in this sad energy isn't gonna help anybody all right i feel like pulling some monology cards so we're gonna see what's going on pisces spirit pisces what is pisces taking on this moment Thank you. Your hard work is paying off. All right. So the little work that you're doing. Pisces, the work that you're doing is it's paying off here, Pisces. But I just feel like you think it's I feel like you think I feel like you're I feel like you think it's little. I feel like you think you're not doing enough, but you are. OK, communication is key. Yes. Yeah, speak how you feel. All right. Speak that you feel like you don't have enough. Speak that you feel regretful, that you feel disappointed. Speak up, okay? This teamwork here, your commitment is being tested. Boom. This energy that you're working with, it's testing you. The universe is testing you to see if this is really what you want. So they could be making, you know, like I, like I said, issue after issue or argument or, or roadblock after roadblock. Not saying that it's not for you, but they're testing you like, oh, yeah, Pisces, you, you really want this? This is the energy you want? Okay, we're, we're about to see if you really want this. And they're testing this this um, teamwork here. A new start is coming. So you, 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 there's a new start that's going to that's gonna happen here. All right. And then bottom of the deck is surrender to the divine. Excuse me. Let the universe take care of this. All right. And you focus on yourself right now. All right. I'm going to pull some advice for you. But yeah, Pisces, just you're being you're you, this, this, you're being tested by the universe right now. Okay, so just make sure that you stick in there as I, as I know that you can. All right, Pisces, 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 Pisces. It could also be testing you. We are Mercury retrograde. Okay, uh, they could also be testing you to see if you learned anything. Okay, prior. And this is a a. a Something that that's coming that's that has come back again. Okay. All right. The first card is where are you being journeyed to? So I feel like your intuition could be leading you somewhere, right? And they're absolutely leading you into what healing, into having patience. So that's kind of what they want you to to move go where the universe is pushing you right now okay that's your advice unbound releasing old patterns contracts and past life all right there's a need for you guys to um you know let go of the attachment to someone or something here okay not leave the person forever but leave the attachment as that you need this person or that you need this energy okay you don't need anyone trust the nickel all right what is the nigga trying to trying to tell you, right? There's a feeling that you're feeling that's, that that's the universe trying to tell you something. Your intuition is trying to push you towards a certain direction. Figure out why. And once you get there, hone into those energies because you're going to need that. And then transformation. Yeah, you're going through a transformation right now, physically and mentally. All right? All right, Pisces. Well, that's all that I have for you today. I hope it brought some clarity into your situation. And yeah, Pisces, have a good night or a good day whenever you watch this. And stay positive.